Creative Continuity. We bring the convention to you. All right, I'm Harold Gann with Creative Continuity. I'm here with Jim Chung. So you're mainly known for doing mostly cover art, correct? Uh, and some interiors, but so, mostly for Marvel. Mostly for yeah. Marvel. Outside of Marvel, what other... Uh, I used to work for a company called Crossgen Comics. I did a book called Scion. Um, okay. Sadly, the company is no longer around, but um, you know, luckily Marvel keeps me gainfully uh, employed and All right. very busy. So you've done the uh, X-Men versus the Avengers, correct? Yeah, so I did the covers for that book, yes. Oh, okay. Who's your favorite character to draw um, in the Marvel Universe? I like Spider-Man. I, like I, mean, Spider I grew up reading Spider-Man, so this has always been my favorite character. Spider-Man your favorite? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Anyone else outside of Spidey? Uh, Cap's always fun, and the Hulk. I like doing the Hulk, so luckily I got to draw, you know, Cap and Hulk uh, in Infinity. Right. So that was a lot of fun as well to do. All right. So what inspired you to become an uh, artist? What artist? Always wanted to do it as a kid. Always, always wanted to do it? I knew what I wanted to do from a very early age, like, you know, seven or eight. So when did you school. know that you had a talent for it? Because I saw you draw that Spider-Man. That, yeah, it's, that's incredible. It's just something I just kept doing, even in school, you know, more the teachers just kept drawing, I guess. <laughs> Outside yeah. of this latest project, was there anything else you plan on working on? Uh, currently I'm working on Avengers 35. Uh, it's an issue with Jonathan Hickman. Um, and I'm also doing the Axis covers um, for the upcoming event book. Mm -hmm. And I might be doing uh, some interiors as well for that. Okay. So you, so right now you're just strictly with Marvel. Any uh, thoughts of in the DC at all? No, no, I'm no. exclusive to Marvel. So like I said, there's no time for anything else right now. So who was the most difficult character for you to draw? Most difficult character? The most difficult character is probably always going to be like Galactus or something. You know, mm -hmm. very complicated. Uh, takes a lot of reference, I think. So I don't usually like drawing him unless I get paid. Right, right. <laughs> when they asked you to do a cover for a book, uh -huh. do they give you an idea of what they want? Yes. Or it's just, okay. Yes. Do they ever give you free reign? It's like, okay, we need... Yeah, they give me a rough idea and then I produce some sketches for them and then uh, they just get to pick whichever sketch and then I work it up into a full, fully finished image. Okay, now is it something that is... Uh... Is this something that you give them like, all right, so what do you think of this? No. Well, yeah, well, they approve of the sketch and then I do the pencils and then they approve it and then I ink it and then somebody else colors it. So that's usually the process. My shining achievement, the shining achievement is probably going to be Young Avengers, I think, because it's uh, characters I help co-create and, mm -hmm. um, you know, I'm very proud of them and, um, and they seem to be very popular. So all right, this is right. Jim, Jim Chung. Oh, we're with Creative Continuity.